We have about a 50-50 split of boarders and day girls at Badminton. Every boarding house has a house mistress, a deputy house mistress and a team of resident tutors who are on hand. We have three boarding houses on site. Our junior boarding house is called Bartlett and that goes from 8 years old through to 12, 13. And that's quite a small house, around 30 girls are in that house and we're stood in, in the sitting room now of this house. It has a really homely feel. I love coming up here to see the girls. We ensure that before they go to bed at night, they've got their uniform and things laid out ready for school the next day and their bags packed. And these are good habits that they then carry through as they get older. We then move on to the middle age house, so that's years 9, 10 and 11. And actually Sanderson, which is the middle house, has two floors and each floor has a separate house mistress, deputy house mistress and resident tutors within it. Again, there's a lot of hands-on pastoral care, but it is a much, much bigger building and that has 88 girls in there, so it's, so it's a significant jump. Finally we have our sixth form house and that has girls in lower six and upper six and is very much a sort of pre-U experience. They're able to do a bit more independent cooking, that sort of thing. The boarders in Bartlett and Sanderson leave the houses in the morning and come to school. So it's very much like being a day girl, you can't nip back and get your pencil case or your PE kit or anything like that. And then that changes in the sixth form, so when the girls come to the sixth form, the house is open, so the day girls will arrive on a the morning, they have their own study spaces and lockers, and obviously the boarders have their bedrooms upstairs, and they will come down, so they're very much mixed together. For me, the pastoral care underpins everything that we do here because if a child is not happy and well within themselves then they're never going to perform to the best of their abilities. And also we teach them about self-care because it is that sort of longer term view of getting them ready for university and the wider world.